Ladies and gentlemen, we are getting the emails. That's right, many of the emails that Hillary Clinton deleted, which were thought to be gone forever, were actually preserved on a backup device called a Datto device, which was turned over to James Comey's FBI in 2015. As the entire Hillary Clinton email investigation went on, James Comey sat on that device and never searched it. This is a major potential case of obstruction of justice. Well, thanks to citizen researcher Larry Kawa, thanks to the coverage of big league politics, thanks to the lawyers at Judicial Watch, there is a court ruling now, a circuit court ruling from Judge Randolph Moss, who has ruled that the State Department must search this device and release its contents by September 1st of this year, right before the midterm elections. This is a big win for Trump supporters in this ongoing war against the deep state. We are learning more and more shocking information every day about the anti-Trump conspirators and the lengths that they went to to subvert the law in order to target President Donald Trump and his team. James Comey, we have learned, held a meeting at his home with his brother Peter Comey during the investigation. Peter Comey is a top executive at DLA Piper, the very law firm that did the Clinton Foundation's taxes and performed the so-called independent audit of the Clinton Foundation that prevented the Clinton Foundation from being criminally charged by the FBI. James Comey's meeting with his brother Comey presents a massive conflict of interest and potentially another obstruction of justice charge. Robert Mueller, meanwhile, is coming under fire. After it was revealed that he began investigating Trump campaign manager Paul Manafort while he was a partner at the very law firm that Paul Manafort was using to represent him in the case. That's right, Paul Manafort was using Wilmer Hale as his legal representation at the time that Rod Rosenstein sent an email to Robert Mueller telling him to begin investigating Paul Manafort. That is literally the definition of conflict of interest. There are so many disqualifying factors here, but Trump supporters need to stay on the offense and they need to stay vigilant. The fact that Hillary Clinton's secret deleted emails are going to be released by September 1st of this year, according to a court ruling, is a major development in this case. And a lot of people are very happy about it. We're going to stay on this story.